Hi everyone, on July 23rd, I will be doing a transmission for the Ascended Masters and the Elementals to help us celebrate life. In preparation for it, some of us visited our venue of choice to check in with them. Following is a few things our Elemental friends had to say. So we are planning an event for July 23rd at 7 p.m. called the Midsummer Celebration of Life and we will be uh, working with the dragon, Emerald, and we wanted to ask how participants would be able to benefit from this type of session. It is our joy to welcome you here today, Denis. It is our joy to welcome you here today and always. It is our joy to welcome you and any groups of people that you wish to bring to this place and allow them to become enlightened. For that is our mission as well. Although we might not be Ascended Masters, nor Angels, nor Archangels, we are still beings of the light. For We are all participate in creation as we are part of the Creator in all that is, of course. And so we, as the Elementals, come and speak to you in consideration that you do not necessarily understand what we are nor who we are. But let us tell you that we are filled with joy. Joy and laughter, you could say. For that is our job, is to bring joy and laughter in the world. Some of you might call us tricksters or might be afraid of us because you don't understand us or do not look like us but let us tell you that we are here to bring joy joy and laughter joy and laughter so we welcome you here today in that land that you call petri island as the dragon allows this information to come through through the channel at this moment so we ask you to breathe into your heart yes you will have heard that many times before this is because it is one of the rules or one of the laws that exists within this universe for us to connect to one another. And so why Petri Island? Is there a connection between between you the dragon and the Petri Island? Petri Island is one of the energetic points that are located along the Ottawa River. You would see it as Meridians, we could use that word within your own body. The river is a type of meridian in certain spots within the river hold a specific type of frequency. The dragon's job, or you could say its work on the land, is to hold it strong and steady or grounded as not to allow just anything or anyone to cross through that dimensions because it is its job to keep the land grounded and in balance. It is a type of balance that it brings into this specific land. You will understand that it is not the only dragon that exists within this reality, for there are many, many other dragons such as himself and many, many other dragons that exist in other areas in order to do the work they have to do all together, all of us work together in our own unique way, you could say, the same way that you as a human works in his own unique way in his own incarnation.